chair now recognizes the gentleman from Tennessee. Thank you, Mr. Chair. Chairman Kahn, I thank you for being here and for putting up with some of the questions you have been asked. Yesterday, FBI Director Ray sat here for almost five hours and put up with continual questions attacking his patriotism, his judgment. Uh, it was really amazing, the hypocrisy that was shown. The issue was weaponization of the FBI. And yet, every member of this panel who was here on January 6, 2021, knows that the government was weaponized on that day, as I said, nuclearized, to take over the government, to overthrow the government, in contradiction of the oath of office that each of us had taken, and that we've learned that certain members of this committee went and met with Donald Trump, and that they were participating in the overthrow of our government, the nuclearization slash weaponization of our government, and yet they had the chutzpah, the audacity, the lack of integrity to question Ray's judgment, and went on and on. And I'm sorry, I came in here today, and I'm Is sorry. the gentleman accusing us of a lack of integrity? Mr. Chairman, if you would ask whoever it is to shut up. I was I'm sure the chairman will rule when he comes back. When I came back. in today, and I heard some questions about your relationship with the Bar Association, hey, you don't talk about rope in a house where a man's been hung. You don't ask about membership in the Bar Association on a Judiciary Committee where there are members who never pass the bar and aren't members of the bar. And they are members of this committee in good standing. So we need to get beyond the hypocrisy and realize where we are and don't raise such subjects. Chairman Kahn, let me ask you this. The Federal Trade Commission deals in issues that protect consumers. And subscriptions to magazines, to services on the subscription services for media are everywhere, and you can subscribe to them easily. But it's hard to unsubscribe. It's difficult to find that spot. Uh, this has been a problem to consumers, and the companies just make money hand over fist as people give up on trying to unsubscribe or cancel their membership. What steps is the FTC taking to reel in these predatory practices?